What is up everybody, The Red Dragon here, and we are checking out the latest news of the day. And I came across this story, and when I first read it, I was like, you know what, it's April 1st, this is not a real story. But it turns out this story was actually published a couple of days ago, so this is legit and real, and uh, is just further proof that we are, you know, eventually going to see a day where machines are taking over everybody's job, and, and we're left wandering around twiddling our thumbs, wondering what, what is there for humans to do. So, this is a little test that is happening in France and there is a newspaper company who is planning on delivering your papers not by you know some little kid on a bicycle throwing out newspapers not by some mail carrier who's driving one of those old-fashioned automobiles no they are planning on delivering newspapers by using UAVs, Unmanned Aerial Drones. They have developed a, a certain drone that can carry newspapers and they're going to be testing it out starting in May. And so they've got 20 workers that they are uh, training right now. And you can control these UAVs with iPads and computers and things like that. And so they're training right now to start delivering papers. And they say, look, you know, if you ain't gotta work your way around the roads, you can just go straight to a place. You can hop over buildings and houses and fences and dogs and all this other stuff and deliver the paper right where it needs to be delivered and they think that they'll be able to do it faster than you know uh, I guess the old-fashioned way of actually having somebody to actually go and do it and of course you know if they are able to uh, pin this down and work out all the quirks and and get better battery life and all this other stuff uh, eventually you're going to have it where they could just type it into a GPS system and it automatically knows where it needs to go deliver the papers and to come back and then you know why do you even need somebody controlling it with an iPad at that point and of course this is not the only company who is looking at using UAVs in order to deliver mail in fact FedEx has made it known that they want to also be able to use drones in the future because if they use passenger airplanes as it is right now they have to pressurize the planes in order to do that and that actually costs a lot of money and it's time consuming and all that and so if they could have a system where they're using drones to deliver your mail back and forth they say that is what they want and of course then they don't have to pay any pilots as well so this is the future guys just a little touch at what is to come and it might be a little bit hard for you to see the the future where everything is you know automated and machines but it's it's gonna get there i'm telling you and we're gonna have to totally change the way we look at everything and the way our system and economy is built up and it, it's kind of scary in uh in some sense but the faa uh they are working on coming up with regulations and rules to make it where drones personal drones can be used by the year 2015 so they're coming up with all these rules and regulations so in the future you are going to start seeing a lot more stuff in the sky flying around so i'm sure ufo reports are going to also increase as well so that does it for me the red dragon if you want to read more about this i'll leave a link in the description box and as always if you like the news be sure you hit that subscribe button uh, to follow me for the latest news and updates for technology and gaming related stuff and just anything cool going on in the world if i come across something cool then i'll give it to you guys that does it for me the red dragon thanks for watching